Welcome back to my channel Tech and Art. Hope you guys doing good today. We will discuss about GMSA account first. So in this video, we will talk about how the GMSA account is helping to SQL Server engine. Okay. So please watch the complete video and whoever newly join on channel, please like to subscribe and don't forget to share. Please visit the channel playlist SQL Server DBA. More than 250 videos, uh, all are on real time scenario basis you know videos which can help you day to day activities if you are getting help please don't forget to share the youtube thanks okay please contribute to youtube thanks for the motivation okay so let me start today's session actually so i have created one documents word documents hope you are able to see so basically the gmsl service account i have defined very short way so group managed service accounts solve the problem of one to one relationship between MSA and computer. This is done by making use of the Active Directory security groups to allow the one to many relationship between account and the computers. So now the point is here before GMSA, we have a MSA concept, managed service account. Okay. So managed service account basically worked on the mechanism one to one only. So breaking that mechanism, we uh, Microsoft introduced, you know, uh, the group managed service account. So basically the group managed service account allowing the, you know, uh, one to many relationship between account and computers. Couple of notes, bullet points I have highlighted here. The SQL Server 2012 only support use the managed service account, MSA account. So 2014 introduced, uh, you know, the support of uh, group managed service account when the running windows service account is 2012 r2 and above so these are the facts prerequisites now the what's the big deal with the gmsa okay so the why we should use the gmsa actually so these many bullet points which can help you to understand why gmsa is really helpful okay the result of using the gmsa in in short that you don't need to use the password for your SQL server service accounts password still exist but they are managed automatically between the server and domain with no human interaction and his uh, and this gives you the following benefits so basically if your service SQL server engine service account is a GMSA account then you no need to worry about the password you no need to capture the password you no need to store the password if sometimes services is getting failed also simply you can you know uh, go to the service and uh, go to the um, uh, properties uh, service account uh, account properties and you swipe up the password and just restart the service it will uh, it will uh, take the restart okay so no need to give anything right so no uh, so basically no need to create a secure password no need to securely store the password no need to retrieve the password and provide uh, for the build scripts no need manual cycle password for security reason and it's done automatically so everything is automatically so it's a big headache uh, which you know uh, reducing this mechanism gmsa basically the group manager service account prerequisites so now the point is uh, what are the prerequisites uh, for this so domain function level 2012 or higher sql server 14 or higher windows Server 12 r2 operating system active directory powershell module installed so these are the bullets uh, points uh, which is help you to you know if you are going to create a gmsa account so uh, before creating the account you need to do pre-checks these uh, points okay how do we create the GMS account? So I will try to cover in the next video how to create. If you, if you, it will be a longer video, if we will go step by step now. Okay. So hope based on this, you know, uh, in short document uh, can help you to understand the GMS account concept. Okay. N number of blogs there, n number of uh, you know videos we, you can get it. But uh, I think. Uh, what are the really highlighted points about the GMSA account I have covered. If you are getting help, please share to others also. So others also can take the benefit and we all can grow together. We'll meet you soon. Till then, bye-bye. Thank you and thanks for watching.